Hello Libra, how are you doing? In this reading, we're going to be spying on them guys. Why not? Hey? So first of all, let me clear the space. You know, if you've been here before, I always clear between readings so that we pick up new fresh energy. I clear the space of any previous energies and readings as well. And I send positive vibes through to you guys. First card out here I'm going to get is an oracle card just to see kind of like what's going on here. And then we're going to look into them. We're going to see all different things, especially about what they're thinking about you, um, what's currently going on in their energy and even what their feelings are at the end we're going to get your spirit guides to come in and advise you going forward let's see unknown territory you're exactly where you need to be okay <laughs> um i'm gonna see a bit deeper but i think this is for single people you know i feel like you're walking on a path on your own you don't really know um what's coming in the future but you need to know when they say you're exactly where you're meant to be. Oh, you're exactly where you're meant to be. Right now, the experiences that you are having, it's for a specific reason. It's, wow, that's a weird, weird way of saying it. Spirit God just is grooming you or making you to become the person you're still unfolding to be. That's so interesting. So let's get out energy of a person. Who are they going to show us here? Who are they going to show us? Let's have a look and see Libra. Who comes up for you? Emperor in the reverse position. Wow. Okay. And the page of voices in here. Um, oh, wow. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to have to say exactly what's coming up in the reading because that's what I'm supposed to do. Um, I do feel like you're connecting to somebody here. There is a person you're connecting to, maybe through work as well, because the emperor being in the reverse position, that kind of tells me this person, you know them through work. Or if you don't know them through work, they can be a very... Um, work focused person maybe like a business person or a person who's building some kind of career they got the page of voices in the reverse position it tells me there is somebody around you there's just an element here of maybe a bit of a warning coming through here with regards to this person maybe this is what you need to hear okay so the page of voices um they their energy is a bit off um for me okay with the king of, with the emperor being there as well, which is Aries as energy also, it tells me they can be a bit cold, a kind of a cold person. And with that reverse page of voices there, it's it's fun, it's exciting to connect to this person and talk to them. But there's an element of them kind of like being a bit unstable, you know, with regards to connecting to people and relationships. So let's see what they think about you. I'm really curious to see what's going on. Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, let us be very careful. I just got to tell you, wow, be very careful. Um, you are being very careful. I see it now. Nine of Inspiration coming up here. And um, they do see you careful with regards to relationships and all those things. The Nine of Inspiration is Nine of Wands energy. You do have your walls up towards them. Um, I feel like when you connect to them, it's kind of like, Wow, it's kind of a bit exciting. But the thing is, yeah, they got a 10 of materials up there in the reverse position. I'm going to have to tell you. Guys, if you're connecting to somebody new, you know if this is your person or not. Because if I'm speaking, you, you can understand, yeah, no, that's, you're describing them. Then you know that this is your reading. Be very careful because I don't feel like this person is planning long term something with you. I feel like it's just what they're doing right now and you there. You know what I mean? The Ten of Pentacles in the reverse position, it tells me they're not thinking with regards to you about I'm getting married to this person and I'm going to settle down and we're going to have babies and a house and all that. That's not what they see towards you. They just, I don't know what they're doing. Okay, um, I'm sure you're also going, I don't know what they're doing. So be careful. Okay, that card kind of like just shot out there. The hangman, yeah, they. this is their feelings towards you. Um, the side here, I'm asking what they're thinking, what they're feeling. They are holding back their emotions completely from you. They're not falling in love with you. The hangman, which is the hang muse here, is the hangman card. It tells me they're holding back. They're hanging in there. They're not opening up to you as you think they are. There's a lot of things, I think, that go on in their mind that they don't reveal to you. Duh. I mean, look at the chain of materials. Let's see what else comes up here. Be careful, guys. I love you guys so much. Everybody who watches my readings, whenever I do the readings, I pick up on your energy. It's so, it's so nice to pick up on your energies. And when I feel it, I just get this overwhelming like expansion of love in my heart towards all of you. And I'm warning you guys, be careful here. The Eight of Cups comes up here. This person is not serious about this. They're just playing. You know, I don't know what they're doing. But yeah, you being single right now, 
That's exactly where you need to be. This is not a connection that's coming in to change you. You're still heading on a road towards something. This is a tree that you're passing on the street. It's rooted in the ground. It's not traveling with you up the road. Okay, uh, so let's have a look. You're being guided, though. I'm going to tell you one thing. Um, trust, even if this is not working, because I don't feel like you madly in love with this person or anything like that but be careful that you don't fall in love because they will walk away from this connection they're very careful not to fall in love or anything like that so this is almost like you know you're passing one of the trees on the road to your destination and you are being guided by your spirit guides they are like literally going please 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 don't let this hurt you we're taking you somewhere trust that we know where we're going oh my golly guys oh Trust that we know where you're going. You got a Ten of Pentacles. This is their their deck. This is that advice that they give. Ten of Pentacles. They like literally going. You know what? I saw that card. I can't deny. It. I saw the Moon card, guys. They always say if you see something, don't deny it. So I'm gonna go look for the Moon card. Literally, we got a Page of Cups being here as well. There is love coming in. There's the Moon, and there's a Page of Cups that I saw. There is new love coming here. There is new love. You're on the path now. You're still on this path. They are telling you, we know. We know you don't know where you're going. The moon card literally talks about unknown territory. And there it is. Pisces is energy as well with the moon card coming in here. So you've got Aries. You've got Pisces. Um, you're literally on a road to somewhere. And you don't really see the Ten of Pentacles. But your spirit guides, they do see it. They're like, your road, your destination is taking you here. This is not with this person. The Ten of Pentacles is in the reverse position. It's come up now twice. And it also indicates to me, because the Ten of Pentacles has come up twice, it does talk about you possibly very soon entering into a new cycle of living and being, which could be a new relationship as well. I promise you, I saw the, the cups here. I can't deny. You know, I saw this page of cups energy. Underneath is a Knight of Swords. There is something coming in here. There is something coming in. It's just that you don't yet see it. Trust that you in the right place at the right time, doing the right thing to find the person you're meant to find that's going to lead you to this Ten of Pentacles. Goodness me. There we go, guys. I'm loving your reading. It's very beautiful. Um, it's positive, very positive reading. So um, even though this is a bit of a warning, but what's coming for you still is very positive. Trust, trust, trust that you're going in the right direction. Guys, if you do like the reading, please hit that thumbs up button. Even subscribe if you want to do so. Otherwise, I'm sending you all my light and love and I'm wishing you the best moving forward. Bye.